Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So back in 2022, I posted a video regarding Google search Easter eggs you can try out to pass some time. So if you have a couple of minutes to spare, you can try out some games and also tools. And some of them are actually useful, some of these tools. And Easter eggs using Google search. Now, that was quite a while back I posted that video. And just to do a kind of update to that previous video, which I'll leave down below, and just to have a look at a couple of more additions to uh, the Google Play games. So basically hidden games and tools you can use um, in Google search without having to download any games or tools to your actual drive. Now, first of all, and in no particular order, we have Pac-Man. And I mentioned Pac-Man in, in that previous video, but obviously this is a very popular game. And you can play Pac-Man directly in your browser um, by just doing a search for Pac-Man in your Google search. Then the next one is uh, Google Snake. And the same applies. You can play Google Snake by just doing a search um, for the um, Google Snake in your search. And then moving on to Minesweeper, you just do a search accordingly, Google Minesweeper, and there you go. You can then play Minesweeper directly in your browser. You get the idea. The same with Google Solitaire, Google Tic-Tac-Toe, Memory Game. And with this Memory Game, this is, this is what I featured previously. Besides the actual Memory Game, we've got some tools here. So you've got a metronome you can use, an on online metronome. So I mean, that can keep track of um, your different beats per minute and so on. If we head back, we've got a tuner. So you can actually uh, use this to tune your guitar as an example. And you get a Meditate, Rolladar, Calculator. And if we scroll through those, you've got Flip a Coin. This one's quite handy, actually, if you need to flip a coin. And you have no coin in your pocket, as an example. That's also quite useful. So there you go. Over and above that memory um, game, you've also got these different tools. And you can get to these tools by just doing a search for Google Memory Game. And then we've got the different doodles.google games. So these are the different games that Google ha has applied to the doodles. And the doodles are normally these little uh, graphics we get here at the top of the search when different events roll out in different regions. So you've got a couple of these uh, that you can play. I'm um, using the um, search doodles.google and he has a couple of others underneath here, coding and so on. Let's just have a quick look. There we go. So you get the general idea. So there we go. And then, of course, um, another one you can play, and this is um, very popular, is called Dino Run. And this one actually can be played without having to be connected to uh, the online world. So you don't have to be connected to the internet to play Dino Run, as many of you all know. So even if you're offline and you've got a couple of minutes to spare, you can play Dino Run. And obviously, this is the most common and popular so-called game when it comes to um, little hidden games you can play directly in the browser. And as you can see, I don't play this very often. So um, the game over already for me. But I'm trying to multitask here. So there we go. You get the idea. So that's just a couple of hidden games and tools you can get access to. Uh, if you've got a couple of minutes to spare and um, obviously you can try out these games and tools and they, these are also referred to as Easter eggs using Google search. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.